some trails, as beautiful as they are, can just be simple sanctuaries of plants, pebbles, and a path. But this isn't that trail. Love being out in nature. Tim Schmidt knows how different this place is because he's been helping maintain a stretch of this trail called the Mason Dixon Trail for decades. I'm not sure there's a section I've missed. The full trail is 200 miles long and winds through parts of Pennsylvania, Maryland and Delaware. We use the, the blue blazes. A single blaze means you're on the trail. This section is just north of Lock 12 in York County. When you're here alone, you feel like you're just way out in the wilderness somewhere. And while the trail here is peaceful, it sure isn't quiet. And that's what makes this stretch such a surprise, because right in the middle of the wilderness, you find this, a beautiful cascading waterfall called Mill Creek Falls. Water roars down a 25-foot drop and splashes up against rocks and logs until it eventually pours into the Susquehanna River. It's not very common that this kind of falls happens so close to the river. They're usually way up by the mountains. Schmidt told us the creek at one time had been dammed up, and energy from the falls powered a sawmill along the river. The dam and mill are no longer here, and the erosion caused by the now free-flowing cascade has pushed the falls farther from the shore. It's a unique feature of the Susquehanna River. And it's here to enjoy, the perfect spot for a picnic on the rocks, a nature photo shoot, or a place just to take a breath. There's apparently a psychological prop property to waterfalls that are one of the features of nature that is especially common. There are other spots to see along the Mason-Dixon Trail, but the falls are hard to beat and hard to miss, too. Exploring the outdoors at Mill Creek Falls at Barcaro WGAL News 8.